Hey guys, what's going on? How you guys doing today? It's uh, Sunday, 6.43 p.m. I don't know why I had to tell you the time. I just I have to tell you the time for some reason. So I want to talk about uh, some things and that thing happened to be a rumor, which could possibly be true. So without further ado, blah, blah, blah. I don't want to talk about it. And, and I just want to show you pictures like right now. Boom, in your face. Look at this. Do you, are you guys seeing what this is? This is the AMD Phenom. Four IV 12 core 12 threads okay 75 watts 24 megs of level 3 cache oh my goodness are you seeing this now if you may have looked closely enough at this image you would see that it actually says am4 right you like up oh, yo there's no problem I got an am3 plus motherboard that would be compatible with it no 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 uh, that won't be the case because this one here is 1356, 1356 pins. So it's not going to fit in your AM3 Plus case. Since we were all hoping for, I was hoping for this. That's the reason why I went out and I bought this. A Sabertooth motherboard, five year warranty. Okay, I've been able to have it for a good while. And you know, AMD has their great backwards compatibility, compatibility support. And that was something I was hoping for. I was like, you know what? I could buy AM3 Plus motherboard and then, you know, a few years down the line when AM4 comes out, I will be able to, excuse the plane, I'll be able to just buy the processor and just put it in there. That'd be really cool. You guys think they, they have a big game changer coming up here? Because 1366, again, this is just a rumor. It's not something that's going to happen. And it's not in their lineup of processors to be released. Maybe it's a surprise. Surprise party. It happens. Uh... But, uh, but this thing is beasting though. I mean, six. Oh, I forgot the memory frequency. I apologize. I'm so sorry. Six gigahertz. 1.4. What is that? 3.6? Yep. 1.436 volts. Six gigahertz. 24 megabytes of level 3 cache. 12 cores. Yeah, you're right. I'm, I'm, I'm going to sell this. Anybody want to buy it? No. Nope. I mean, if it's, if it's true, I will definitely sell my computer. My entire computer. Everything with it. I'll sell it all, and I'll buy. Well, I, won't, I won't buy it like immediately. I'll have to see how it perform against the 3770, uh, 4770K, and I'll have to see the price range because you know AMD got a little crazy with their uh, the five gigahertz processor when a thousand dollars price point. I mean, it's twelve cores, and if it is real, how much do you think they're gonna charge? Fifteen hundred, two thousand. The world's first 12 core processor. Uh, this is good if it's real. As usual, it's Asian, Chinese. It's Chinese. So if it is real, kudos to AMD. I mean, it, it has me a little bit. 12 cores, 25 nanometers, also. I think you guys don't want to know that. 25 nanometer process, 12 cores, 75 watts. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But it, it did get me pretty excited, even though it's probably fake. And this guy is probably trolling us and laughing as everybody gets excited for it. You know how people are. They live off this stuff. So 25 nanometer, 1.436 volts, AM4 sockets. So much for backwards compatibility. I'm hoping it is a lie. I'm hoping it is a lie. I really am. But it, it looks legit. But it can still be, this can still be fake. So I'm not gonna say it's true because probably 12 core, six gigahertz. Man, that is well, that would be amazingly fast. I'm not gonna say nothing else. It's a rumor. I'm getting too involved with this. I'm getting too caught up with it. It's a rumor, okay? And there's no roadmap for it. Like the, the roadmap AMD shows what's coming out. This is not in there. So I think we've been trolled. In that case, if you got excited, you've been trolled. So unless it comes out, then uh, it says it's gonna come out here in 2014. Uh, 20, 25, anyway, 24, yeah. So 2014, should be, it should arrive um, about somewhere after Steamroller, before Steamroller. So 2014 is where you gotta look out for it, which it probably won't happen. I mean, 12 core, 6 gigahertz, 75 watt thermal design power. Whoa, AMD. Like that's that's huge compared to the 220 watt <laughs> 5 gigahertz. Like that is huge. Uh, so yeah, the code name is Becca. That's the code name. Yeah, never heard of it. So we'll wait. We'll see what goes on with this and see what happens. I mean, that's all we can do. I mean, the specs alone just gets you hype, right? You're like, AMD's gonna do this. So yeah, the specs alone will get you right. And if if they were to go ahead and do that. With the 100 and 1,356 pins, which would require me to throw away my computer and get a new motherboard. That's not like an AMD fanboy, right? 
it, it just depends on who perform. I'll, I'll perform too. You know, I think AMD is great for the price. So let's hope they don't have a breakdown like they did with the five gigahertz processor and put that shit at two thousand bucks or a thousand dollars because I would not do it. I'll just switch to Intel. Um, but uh, yeah, it's nice to know and nice to see, even though we're probably being trolled by this Chinese guy laughing right now, eating lo mein, like laughing right now, looking at people react to this shit. Are there any videos on YouTube with this, of, of this processor? Probably not. Like, nobody's like talking about it. He's gonna look at my videos, he's gonna laugh his ass off. Like, he, like this dude doesn't even know what's happening. So he's probably gonna look at this and laugh his ass off. But this is really cool, nice to see. Uh, even though it's a rumor and probably not real, we're being trolled and stuff. But it would be nice if this could happen. You know, bring back the Phenom series. Um, I have a Phenom myself, so it'll be nice to see. So what do you guys think about this? Fake, being trolled, leave a comment below, and as always, talk to you later.